Hi everyone, today I just like to give you a brief demonstration of how to factory store an EasyIO F Series controller. So, factory restore, this really is the last resort. It's not something you should find yourself having to do on a daily basis. If you really find yourself in a situation where you can no longer connect to a controller, uh, you've exhausted all the usual checks, such as checking your Ethernet port, checking your cable, checking your IP address. It could be that you just don't know your IP address as a controller. And as a last resort, to gain access, you can always do a factory restore. What you do need to realise is that a factory restore will delete all the contents of that controller, including any software, any history database, any dashboards, etc. So ideally, what you really do require is a current backup to restore after that factory reset as there is no going back. So if you've got yourself to that situation, what we'd like to show you now is the simple steps for you to do that. So, those are the simple steps you need to take to factory restore the EasyIO F-Series controller. All you need to now do is upload your backup and you're good to go. Thanks very much for watching.